We have lots of orders. We have lots of, we've done probably over 500 orders, delivery orders on this island since this has happened. If you live on Mercer Island, Island Books owner Laurie Rachis is bringing literature right to your doorstep in a socially distant way, of course. We get a lot of yells and virtual hugs. And even if you don't live there, you can still order books online from Island Books and have them shipped or just pick them up. In fact, lots of bookstores are shipping out books like King's Books in Tacoma. Sure, you won't get to say hi to Herbert, but you'll still have a good book to curl up with. And while you can buy books from a local bookstore's actual website, there's also bookshop.org, a bookselling website that actively supports independent bookstores, like a good book in Sumner. It's a great way to support independent bookstores. Now, if you need a recommendation on what to buy, Laurie suggests Lisa Jewell for addictive thrillers. She's a great writer of um, the thrill. You know what else is thrilling? Ada's Technical Books and Cafe in Capitol Hill offers a book subscription service. For $15 a month, a curated book selection will be delivered right to your door. You can choose different categories like young adult and feminist science. Anything people can do to support bookstores is great. As Laurie just said, that's pretty much it. Buy one book, buy three books, buy 10. Don't worry, I won't judge. Because as much as you miss your local bookstores, they miss you too. And not just because you buy their books. That we're all, we're all really missing it. But we are very lucky because this community is supporting us. And we just hope that it all comes out well on the other end. How about this? Let's all just pretend to be the author of this story for a second. All of our favorite bookshops, they all live happily ever after. The end. Thanks, Ellen, for more.